How's it going everybody? Welcome back to a brand new video and today I'm going to be talking about some things I would like to see added in Sons of the Forest. Of course I know this is an early access game and I love everything they've done with it so far. I've personally had an amazing experience with the game but other than that make sure you like and subscribe and let's get on to number one. So number one the first biggest thing I'd like to see is better story development. Now of course I know this is an early access and the state of the story is going to get pretty much finished once the game comes out of early access but right now I thought the story was just a little bit plain a little bit confusing and after hopefully after early access it does get a little bit more interesting but again I of course I know the story right now is all placeholders and everything is subject to change number two is more caves I felt like as I was exploring as I was going to these caves on the map most of them were just empty and what I mean by empty is once you went in there was no actual cave to go explore it's just an empty room like for example when I climbed up the mountain with my buddy there was nothing in the cave. It was just this room and it felt pointless for us to go all the way up the mountain just to find nothing in the cave. It, it was kind of demotivating in a way, but hopefully they will add more to the caves. Again, I know, like I said, everything's in early access, all subject to change, but uh, I do hope this gets a little bit reworked and fixed. Number three is log sleds. Now I know that you can get Kelvin to bring you resources, bring you logs, but whenever you're working on your own little cabin, I thought, it was, it was a bit time consuming to always go into the forest and get your logs if Kelvin was being a bit slow. It would be really nice to have a log sled. Again, again, this is probably gonna be added in the future, but uh, it'd be really nice to get a log sled in. And number four is a better source of transportation. Now I know we have zip lines, but they are decently limited, limited and we don't really have turtle shells and I don't really know what this sled is used for. I, I crafted it from the 3D printer and I couldn't figure out how to get it to work, but I really do hope with this large map they've added that they find a easier way for us to run around the entire map. And number five is regrowable trees. This is the, one of the biggest things I loved in the original forest was trees would regrow, so you wouldn't have to go so far out into the forest each time you wanted to go get more logs. It'd be really nice to see this outed in the for Sons of the Forest just so we could get more trees growing quicker, especially if we are building larger bases. And number six is the hockeys. I really hope they add that in again because once you're in a cave, yes, the new inventory is great, um, holding eye, it just can be a bit slow if there is a mutant, the teethy, of course, running at you and you need to switch from a spear to an ax or an ax to a spear or whatever. Um, it would just be really nice if you could click four or five whatever and switch to a weapon quickly and number seven is hopefully they can add some kind of in-game tutorial for players just whenever they start up the game like to help them figure out what to do first where to go and i know that the icons on the map and the gps are a way to help players get to those things but it would be nice if they had like some kind of small tutorial for all these people complaining about like the building system or anything like that Again, I don't really think it's much needed or huge priority, but for newer players, it might be nice. And number eight is outfits. I, I really liked in the first forest how you could switch your outfit and how you could like kind of get create your character and make them a little bit more unique by finding like a lumberjack jacket throughout or being able to craft like the Arctic gear. But I feel like whenever I went up to the mountain, it was getting cold like I remember in the original forest you had to make arctic gear to go in the colder area and this one it felt kind of easy just to go right across the mountain I didn't really it, so maybe if they added like some arctic gear that'd be nice but going back to the topic of outfits um, I also hope they add outfits again I know that you're kind of in like the special agents team whatever but it would be cool if you could find different outfits to switch out of the SWAT vest in the future Number nine, I know this is probably going to be added down the line, but maybe just more building options, especially for pre-built stuff. I felt I felt that we were very limited to, for pre-built options and for traps and etc. Like, where are the happy birthday traps and everything like that. So I really hope down the line, I, again, I, I know this they're going to be doing this, but I do hope that we will see some more buildings, building types, building structures we can do and just more creative ways to build. And the next one, number 10 is more lootable items in caves. This was actually talked about by one of my friends while we were exploring and he, he brought up the topic of there's all these items on the ground in the cave but we can't actually pick them up and I definitely feel like if you're playing on harder the harder mode uh, of course it would be nice to find more medications and things in caves because you do deplete your health 
quite quickly once getting hit by these mutants. And it would just be nice if there was some more interactable and lootable items in the caves you could find. Other than that, those are the biggest things I hope End Night Games adds to Sons of the Forest. Again, like I said, I know this game is in early access, all these things are subject to change. We're playing the very first kind of thing of the playable thing of the game, so I just hope that we will see all these things added in the future. That'd be awesome. And let me know what things you guys would like to see added in Sons of the Forest by leaving a comment down below. And uh, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out, everybody.